We're going skiing. plans a few weeks ago to go skiing and snowshoe for the weekend. We decided to go the week before President's Day weekend so we wanted to deal with like all the President's Day traffic of everyone going. I noticed whenever people ski with me, they just go like twice as fast. <laughs> so the weekend finally came for us to go to snowshoe. <laughs> I was incredibly excited. We got there in the late afternoon before our friends, the Godfreys, who were also going to be staying in the condo with us did. So we just hung out really for like the rest of the day. We didn't do much, just kind of getting ready for the next day to go skiing. Excited? Yeah. Excited? Are you going to ski tomorrow? Whew. Have fun? <laughs> Sunrise? The next morning when we woke up, I was up at 7 and had my long johns on by 7.10. Okay, it's 7.25, I've got my long johns on, I've got contacts and my hair's brushed, I'm ready to go ski. Nobody else is out of bed yet, but I can go ski right now. I can go ski. Hi Caroline. Free game, how we feeling? How we feeling? How we feeling? Mom, how we feeling? How we doing, Dad? How we doing, man? <laughs> the minute I clipped into my skis, it was just like the moment was like, ah, it's here, let's go. All these emotions were like, yes, let's do this. <laughs> Of course, I had absolutely no idea where to go since, of course, I'd never been to this mountain before. We go down this cut over right, go down that. We uh, don't know where we are. What? Well, let's go hopefully that lift if we're not going to go to this cup run. So I just kind of followed everyone around until we finally made it to an awesome point on the mountain. Ooh. I think I'm at the point where we just go until we see some black diamonds. <laughs> I think that's going to be my strategy. Yeah, me too. Ah. We're getting somewhere. We're starting to make progress. This part of the mountain had three black diamonds, all steep and longer than 20 seconds, which was actually a shocker, being from the point that you ski in North Carolina for the majority of your life. Oh my God! Holy God. These were the runs that we just hung out on for the majority of the time and we're just always skiing because it was just so much fun. The lift was fast, the conditions were great, it was groomed, it was just so much fun. It's all about that arrow, man. Lying on that one part. He just came up that hill and just straight bombed it. Oh my gosh. All right, we're gonna go eat. Where are we going? Where are we eating? Yeah, we're gonna go eat. All right, we gotta Maybe find some food. We're all hungry. After a while, we went to a local restaurant and got some cheesy fries, of course. And um, I think those cheesy fries were on the table for I think less than a minute until they were gone. Not even like a minute later. It's all gone. Oh my gosh. The fries only held us over for just a little, so when we did go back out, we didn't go out for long, and we only went and skied like on the terrain park for a little till we went and called it a day. Oh my god, did that lady say she doesn't like chocolate? Get her off the show now. <laughs> Why? Get me a baker and not like chocolate. Exactly. Do you just avoid chocolate cakes? Once we were back at the condo, it was everyone was exhausted. So we were just hanging out, just chilling, eating food, you know, just living the life. <laughs> I'm a like cat. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're leaving. Going to Starbucks. <laughs> but of course, none of us could really resist going to Starbucks in the village. So we all got dressed and um, headed to the village for the evening. I don't know about you, I think I'm gonna have chocolate. 
Now, I'm normally someone that just goes to Starbucks and orders a hot chocolate, never really been much of a coffee drinker, but this time I was like, you know what, hey, let's try some coffee, like, let's actually drink Whoa, coffee. You gotta get the, um, oh my gosh, okay, let's try coffee. <laughs> Is this me? Coffee. Of course, I have never actually had a full cup of coffee in one sitting, so I don't know why I chose six o'clock at night for the first time to drink a full cup of coffee, but you know, hey, you know, there's a first time for everything, I guess. I just, I just drank a full cup of coffee for the first time ever. My brain's tingling. All right, ready, so let's break this down. I just had my first full cup of coffee ever. Jack had a cup of coffee and a coffee cake. <laughs> I can't stop laughing either. As Walker's got energy, so he's making a ton of jokes. And Van's ready to fall asleep. How do we think this is gonna play off? <laughs> An experience that I'm glad I had, but just don't know really know how to describe it now. Not gonna lie. Just it it's an experience that happened and yeah. <laughs> she can't stop laughing. Kevin, you gotta love it. No. Hey, we just did it. Yeah, we're It's cold. 30 degrees. It's only 30? Yep. What's the low today? Um, 11. <laughs> <laughs> Score. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Gotta love it. So I can do cups run, Mom, that one run, and then that's it. That's all I film. Because otherwise, yeah. I don't really want to film in 11 degree weather. This doesn't sound very fun. I just don't. Well, it's 30 right now, but it's not 11 yet. I know, but the GoPros barely worked yesterday until the sun came out. For our last day of skiing, the goal was to ski Cups Run. Cups Run had the longest and steepest runs on the mountain, so otherwise you could literally say that these were literally my favorite type of runs. I was like, we can just end it on like one like big fun run, and then the video's over. I'd be like, sorry, I'm done. If this works, it'll be a miracle, but if not, thanks for watching. <laughs> Once we got it over there, at that point, you're just crossing your fingers that the GoPro didn't die immediately to sub freezing temperatures. There you go, let's go. It was just like, <laughs> I did, like, I have no words. I was so excited. Well, well, it's a fitting.